Good evening, everyone, and welcome to Growing Clip Bonsai for Seniors. My name is Tom Novak. Today is August 5th of 2022. It's Friday. It's about 77 degrees Fahrenheit or about like 25 degrees Celsius. Today we're going to think out, outside the box. We're going to try something entirely different. First, I'm going to show you the Sarkul Kalan Vanderetti, something like that. So, well, anyway, it's called a Bushman's Candle. Now I got these from Planet Desert and you can see on the bottom how you can order it. They're only $12 and Dave from Dave's Bonsai, I bet you you can get one of these in Minnesota because they send in the states but they don't ship outside the states I asked already. So here's how they come in because mine died after two years. And I think because of the winter, because of the cold, so I'm going to have to put it this one at a different place. But look how beautiful these plants are. These are only $12.50. Yeah, about $12.50, something like that. And then here's the other one. I ordered, th ordered three. First I ordered one, then I ordered two more. But look, look at a tree you can get out of this. Look at a nice trunk you can get out of this. Now these... What shipping, I think, for two was like 13 something, and it's like, uh, I forgot what it is. It's, it's express mail. So I'm going to show you how I did one, and I think in that, the other pots, I'm going to have to drill bigger holes because they have the drainage holes like this. And all they use is the, the soil, like the sun grow one I showed you. So I planted this one. So the root system's super small. So I didn't do no cuttings on it. You can see how thin the trunk is. So I gotta let this grow so I can get the trunk to thicken up a little bit. Oh, and uh, I forgot to thank Ronald Moose because he says when I made that boo-boo yesterday, he says that try planting the, uh, the, the piece of stem where the roots was on. So I did that, Ron. There you go, Ronald. I got it right there. And oh yes, this is the soil that the the tree that the the Bushman's candle is like. It's got a lot of lot of uh, perlite in it. So, Ron, let's see it. We'll see what happens. Now I'm going to show you the lemon scented geranium. So let me pull that out. Smells like lemon, but look at the trunk it's getting on it. So try that. This was only... Now these, the plants I'm showing you now, I got these from Ted's Greenhouse. So if you're around the Tinley Park area, they're open, uh, I think, from 9 to 3 on Saturday. They're closed Sunday, but the rest of the week, you'll have to check online. But Ted's got some good stuff. But the geranium's only $3.99. Now you're going to say, Tom, I want to take a cutting and root it, and I don't have, you know, if I cut it now, what am I going to do? So, that's where the wet foam comes in. If you don't have time to do plant your cuttings right away, all I'm going to do is snip it right about here and just strip the leaves like that and then if you can see the foam we'll bring it around more all you do is stick it into the foam see how easy and that'll keep until you're ready to put it to root it now our next tree that you can do now this is unique this is a Moujon tea. It's an herbal tea for those of you that can't have caffeine. And like a nice herbal tea. This is also from Ted's for $3.99. Look how big this is. So we're going to have to pot this one. But you make, you strip this and you, and you, uh, you take and you make tea out of it. Now you're going to say, Tom, I want to take a cutting of it. So you do a clip. If you can see it. Now when you strip the leaves, that got a, 
a beautiful smell to it. Now this is what you make your tea out of, but I want to do a cutting. Well, what are you going to do? I can't do it now. I got no time. That's why you got your foam right there. And that'll hold your cutting until you're ready to plant it. Now, we got our garden sage. This is an ordinary garden sage. It's cheap, reliable, and you can do it. It will form a trunk. So what you do is you take it, you root it, I mean, you plant it, and you see the nice little trunk starting to form? And look at the small leaves after I pruned off all the big leaves. So I'll do, I'll plant that in another video. But I just wanted to show you that. And then, Zen from Maybe Bonsai had a good idea of Munstead Lavender. And the reason why I picked the lavender too because Zinn put it in my mind, when I seen this at Ted's for only $3.99, look at this trunk on this thing. This is fantastic. So we're going to have to do a potting of this and a trimming of it. And don't forget, you can take and cut. And you want to root it, strip it like that. Smells good. Now this should go in real easy. They just take the some of the leaves off the bottom there. And all you do is put your cuttings in to your foam until you're ready to root them. So there's our, 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 our lavender. Now something that you can defoliate and use the leaves for your cooking. So this is our bay leaf tree. This one was a little more expensive. This was like uh, $7.99 or $8.99, I forget. But that's your bay leaf tree. And look at the trunk and look at the roots on it. We're going to do a, pot, a potting on this one too. So it's something easy for you to do. Now say you want to, time I want to take a cutting of it, well, we'll just go below here. That's why you got the wet foam. Remember, it has to be a wet foam. You can get that at any craft store and watch the boxes. I mean, the packaging it comes in. Now, you see this? When you defoliate, you don't throw this out. You let it dry and you got it for cooking. I think they use it for meat and stuff. So, all you do is go put it in your foam. And now, the foam is in water. And now you got your cuttings sitting not drying out or anything and then you can go pull them out and you can put them in your uh put it in rooting hormone and plant them so that's something different you can try think out of the box let me put the bay leaf tree there the lavender and the tea and i got to show you my other teas they're starting to grow they're slow growing but i have to repot them but the bay leaves you got them. Look at that. You can defoliate on one branch and let the little ones grow again and give it a shot. And then your tea, you want a cutting, you just strip, put it, dry them out. I have to read up on how you do it, but it's uh, it says a subtle yet exotic vanilla aroma. Grows fine, round, green leaves and tiny orange fruits. Use prime, the leaves are used primarily for green brewing herbal teas and there it is if you can read it so give it a try now uh nigel and uh jay from blue jay bonds i bet you they have a a tea in your in your nursery that you guys go to it's a big one and i bet you they got a bay leaf tree and your wives can use the leaves for cooking so give it a try you ain't got nothing to lose and don't forget use the foam and the best thing to do with the foam is let it sit in the water and let it soak up by itself. Because if you try to force it, even though the foam is strong this way, but by forcing it, it can crumble. So that's a good way to store your cuttings until you can root them. And don't forget to think outside the box. 
that'll make a nice bonsai. I just I just potted it today because I wanted to show it to you. The root system is super small, so when I do one, I'm going to show you how, how to repot it. Now, they, their pots are big. This one had a, you know, got the big drainage hole, but I think I'll drill a couple more holes and put a bigger screen in there. So, you know what tonight is? Tonight is dance night. Wives, get your husbands off the couch. <laughs> Grandma, get Jaja off the couch. Just Grandpa and Bullish, get them off the couch. <laughs> dance a little bit. Put on some old time big band music, sit back, relax, dance. Uh, think about going to some of the nurseries and uh, checking out what you can do something different. And sit back and relax and listen to the old time big band music. A cup of tea and if it's too hot for you, a glass of lemonade. If it's cold like on the other half of the world, get yourself a nice cup of tea or a cup of coffee. And now you know how to make an herbal tea. Moujon tea. Look at that plant. Look at the roots. Look at the trunk on it. I don't know how the roots are going to look, but we'll do that in another video. So you guys take care. Remember Friday night, dance night. Have a slow dance with your wife. Wives, have a slow dance with your husband. You don't have to dance for 10 hours. Dance for a couple of minutes and sit back, relax, enjoy the music. Shut the phone off and just be by yourselves and enjoy each other's company. When you first met, think of the good old days. And the good old days are every day when you're married. So you take care, everybody. Stay healthy. And don't forget, when music was music, big band. Take care.